Every day and every night Every night with Rush Cam, where we talk about it, we talk about whatever we want to talk, we unpack our issues yes. and put them in the little bag. Yes. Alright, so today I have two very good friends of mine, um, two very successful young women and two people that I look up to and admire very, very much. Wow, you look up to me? Yeah. We have Stefana. Oh, saying that. Hi, everybody. <laughs> and we have Naomi Kohan. Hello. So, okay, so Naomi, give us a sentence so let me know your voice. Mm. Mm. A mm. sentence? <laughs> yes. I'm wearing a leopard scarf that Savannah tied for me and I'm really grateful that she did that. Wow. I got you, girl. Savannah, you give us a sentence. Um, you know, <laughs> um, like... Hello, this is not a car <laughs> grammar. <laughs> She's no, like, I mean, <laughs> wait, what should I say? I don't know what to say. I don't know anything to say. I made that coffee. Was the I made coffee and it was really good. That was the sentence? Yeah. Alright, so um, we're going to talk about, for those of you who don't know, Sunday is International Women's Day. Day. Like we're black and there's women's month. You know? Wow. Yes. But like double, double whammy. Yeah. I'm voking. Black History Month gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Black History Month so gone. But our time is still happening. Oh, it's oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. Yeah. Me, I have slow brain today. No. So we I'm all going do. to ask you guys Not one question. Yeah, she's ready. ready. I'm joking. She's I'm ready. Really, I'm ready though. I mean, I am ready since since am. Guys, I'm gonna confess something to you. If you don't hear me, I've never done a podcast with two people who are actually friends and I have I'm super anxiety. Yes. So I'm just going to allow them to speak. So, how do yeah, you feel about crazy. how do you feel about being um on it or in it with three other people though? Like do you feel like it steals your thunder? Absolutely do you feel not. like you look like Destiny's child? Do you think that it's like a group project? How do you feel about Absolutely that? Absolutely not. If mm. anything, I think it makes the wave that much bigger. Yeah. Totally. Because what happens is that when we're a unity, especially coming from an island of Jamaica where the reggae music is just now being like reignited in a way, and I don't want to call it a revival because I hate that term, um, or just Jamaican music being re revived, right? Or not even revived because we've always been popping, but Jamaican music being put on a platform mm -hmm. in the way that it has never been before because people have always been biting our style and then not necessarily crediting us. Mm -hmm. So to have like Jamaican artists representing the music and then to have Jamaican women who are not out of the typical, typical aesthetics yes, and yes. sound. You know, mm -hmm. um, but big up every Jamaican artist. Obviously, we're a woman and we're educated. But not of the typical aesthetic that you're looking for. It's it's mm -hmm. it's, it's necessary to see that it's more than one. Well, you know I, mean? I, mean, I mean, so I and exactly, I would tap on that to say, truthfully, if people group you, it don't matter. Like if they're gonna look into each person, they're gonna see that they're different. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like for me. I think my constant message to myself is just running your lane, running your lane, running lane, do your thing, be nay, be Naomi. Um, so no matter if I'm in a group or if I'm by myself, that will shine. Yeah. And then what I loved about being featured in this particular magazine and even having a conversation with a journalist, yeah. Big Up Shereen, Big Up Shereen, is that I knew she wanted content that was different. Yeah. yeah. So in other words, I was able to talk about depression. Yeah. And it was actually added. A lot of times I have these conversations with writers mm -hmm. and it's just like, daughter of this and that, boom, boom, boom. It's like, Click okay, baby, cool. sensationalist. Yeah, yeah, it's like, all right, cool. Thanks, thanks for the feature. But you know, let's talk about the stuff that people would want to maybe understand about the journey of an right. artist. Right, and then that's how you get to understand a person's character anyway. So. For me, it was. It, I thought it was brilliant that the four of us were featured together. And and do you find that it's uh, a question that people would probably, because when you go when you when you watch shows like The Real or The View, blah blah blah, they always say, but you wouldn't ask men this or you wouldn't whatever mm -hmm. whatever. Do you feel like people have been comparing you guys to each other, whatever? Because you are women, what do you feel about mm -hmm. that? No, um, people, that people, dynamic. Yeah, well, you remember, I don't know of a time in Jamaican music where there has ever been women this many united. women 
in the space, not even united, like mm-hmm. women in the space in period space, who yeah. are being seen yes. and being heard and getting some kind of like energy or buzz around mm-hmm. them, yeah. mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Um, and that's because it's never really been safe enough. There hasn't been a time in Jamaican music safe enough for women to be themselves without having, you know, without being asked to like barter their bodies to get a feature on a song mm-hmm. or, you know, shit mm-hmm. like that. Um, so it's, 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 it's super necessary that we're just pushing every woman forward now. And if we can push forward and forward one time. Well, first of all, I don't know if people are comparing us and if they are. They, are, they absolutely are comparing I haven't us. heard it. But I don't really business. Yeah, oh, no, they, they are they are comparing us. I get I get it all the time. Yes, but but it is, all the time, guys. what it is. You, it's it's, it's 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 comparison because they don't they don't it's have it's comparison because they don't and by the way before i even say what i'm gonna say i just love the fact that five to ten minutes ago these girls were screaming all over the place and now we're settled they just have the range they have the range they do anything you want them to do anyways um i don't think that people know better so it's easy um, to it's compare. It's easy to compare. Yeah. So like when I just got when I just started um doing YouTube I want to Lord him so like quite Perry. He look like quite Perry is brown and dark. He look like quite Perry. But the face is even similar in yeah, shape. Exactly, or but guess what? They don't have any other benchmark. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So when Absolutely. Ariana Grande comes and Ariana Grande has this wonderful sound, right. they're like who who it's on like quit on like quit on like quit on like so it's not people's fault and I don't take them seriously no, because they I, don't know better yeah honestly that's super key not taking things personally and not internalizing it and yeah. staying focused on what I just that your noise. purpose in this space is totally and that's, that's what I do like I'm not trying to compare myself to anybody I'm comparing myself to myself and what I did last time can yes. I make sure that can I up the aesthetic can I up the edge can I up the sound you can't like just have to be yourself constantly. and even so you can't be competing with yourself because you become too hard and true hard yourself. But in other words, like, I don't even get in that frame of mind. And if I do, I pull myself out because it's easy to fall into it. And then the minute I feel it, it just causes this really murky feeling inside of me. I'm like, that's not cool. No creativity can flow from that. No love can flow from that. And you snap out of it really quick because at the end of the day, like, who am I reporting to? Yeah. It's me. Yeah, you know, I'm like, like when you get old and whatever, like, who are you reporting to yourself? Yeah, You're not so, reporting to, yeah. to Seb and not reporting to anybody. It's just... Yeah. So. And, and honestly, me get a different kind of motivation when I see other women around me working and pushing. Yeah. That makes me want to work harder. And exactly. Harder. And, and you want to run yeah. alongside them. Like, yeah. you know, like when we were able to... And I'm to, genuinely not even saying this because it sounds good. Like, literally, <laughs> oh, that's oh, how, I was gonna say because, that's how I'm motivated. Because yeah. I've met, I've met some people who are like all about women's empowerment and they say it no, they but talk they're not the talk but they're, they're not to. walking no the and, then, and, and, then, and then you have those people too where they're all about women's entertain, like empowerment on, on, in, on camera yeah, but I'm true. saying that I want to camera because it looks good, it sounds good, it's what's trendy now. But right? you genuinely believe But I it. genuinely, this is, and that that is what I think makes it different for the four of us because we genuinely believe in in supporting each other. No, totally, totally. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Showing up for each other. We don't. In the back of my mind, I'm not spitefully thinking, yeah, man. Why she have an earring on Moshe? Why me never have a bigger earring? And I'm like, me now, yeah, I'm not. Why never have a bigger earring? Bigger oh, earring. Or, or, or like. Nice thing, but I feel so like no, but here's the thing because the truth is so, for example, if we were in that, if we were false about this whole thing, People I wouldn't feel comfortable yeah. knocking on your hotel door. Oh my god, what do you think about this outfit, Riri? Really? Because I would be in my own, you know, sometimes when people are afraid of their they have a competition mindset, yes. yeah, you work in silos and you kind of block out and you think okay i'm just gonna work on this by myself and then shock the world yes, yes but yes, if there's yes, no yes, collaboration yes. Yeah. yes but when you trust somebody you know you're like yo like for example the first outfit i was gonna wear to rum fest i sent it to you i sent yeah. it to you and you're like you know nay i feel like i've seen you do big off a stage yeah mm-hmm. and it pushed me to go big up icon's image yeah <laughs> clap to you okay and I went somewhere. <laughs> I got a little fire suit, right? Yeah. So just to say, like, I trusted you enough yeah. to share that with you. Know, if I didn't trust you, I'd have been like, yeah, I got my faithful rum face. You know, and I mean, I didn't have to show you. Yeah. But I'm just saying. Yeah. Those are the small things right. that show. Because no, absolutely. And that's and I'm, and I'm to finish my point. Like 
That's why I'm saying I'm, I'm not. No, 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 no. But that's I'm, what I'm saying. I'm, 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 that's why it's so. That's why it's, it's making the impression and the impact that it's, it's making. Yes, because it's all together. It's because authentic. Because it's real. It's yeah. authentic. And, and, too, and it's not, oh, let's do this to create a big oasis. It's not, yeah, so I have a shoot can. with these guys and I don't talk to them otherwise. Or I have a shoot and yeah. there's nothing else in between. Yeah. Or really, really like, like, literally, it was that quilt opener her show with Jack yesterday. I didn't have to say that. Like, mm -hmm. I'm not trying to prove anything. But, like, I genuinely, you know. And when I go back to the archives, actually, and I look at um, Savannah's. Um, Instagram and I, I went on on Leela's down at the bottom and from jump from like 2016 2017 these girls have been supporting each other and it's always been like a, a wave and, and all of that um so that makes me happy because I know that in a space where you're not really sure especially with entertainment where yeah. and entertainment to me is so fickle so fickle. So today Naomi is the hot thing, then tomorrow is seven and what it, it it fickle. So mm -hmm. I'm glad that you guys have a foundation of friendship that yeah. you can stand on. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. honestly, if me now feel somebody, there's no way like no way you'd get me to reach out. Because yeah. barely I talk to people like regardless. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. and, 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 and to begin I with. just thought about the fact that you're saying seeing other women work hard on whatever um motivates you and it keeps you in a place of excellence. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes. In other words, so for example, um, nobody can say that any of us, you know, sing fully off key and Rary, which is like some basic things. Yeah. But I feel proud to stand beside you. No, I don't know if that's basic. I don't know no. if it's basic. I think that's. Sure I think so. it should be basic in music. But I'm just saying, I feel proud that you and I. Yeah, yeah. If we go on a stage and boom, you you start seeing something, I can just like harmonize with you. Yeah. And I know there's. I don't even have to worry. Yeah. But like to me, that's that's us like working. We we're working on our craft. Yeah. And we keeping can, the bar. Keeping yeah. the bar because mm -hmm. not to say you pull away from people that are not performing as well, but it's hard. You know, like I said, people around you is a representation of. Where you are, and I'm trying to be excellent. You know, and yeah. so it's 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 so dope to feel like yo, you know, like I joke around and, like freestyle. You know what I mean? Like you know, be like yo, Savannah, I'm not them coming on the caravan, and like you know, wow. but <laughs> it's Savannah, true. I'm not them coming on the caravan. Listen, when she when we're gonna go to IRFM. She got crack up everybody. Yeah. Bust out loud, just saying the most random thing. It was great. But just to say about somebody like Alila, who that is one of her strengths. Yeah. In a way, she motivated me. Even though I might be joking. Yeah. But yeah. I know that's about yeah. her. And so I'm like, yo, she's so dope when it comes to that. Boom, boom, boom. And then the other day when we were up in up at the studio, yeah. she was I was she was trying to practice her harmonies, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah. And like we we're playing the guitar and she's like, okay, boom, boom, boom. So we you say something in that person, you're like, girl, teach me what you got yeah. right on yeah. yeah. That from, is from so true. From style to literally your craft. Oh yes. my god, that's so true. And I've even noticed that in YouTube, like yeah. um like the circle of friends that you have and all of those things. You're like, I like for example, I don't like to vlog. Mm -hmm. Like I, I it makes me vlog. uncomfortable yeah, really. like to be in the streets or to be just out and about living my life. But I know, say, somebody else is really good at vlogging, for example, and they inspire me with that. Mm -hmm. So then I pick up a little bit there, mm -hmm. and, and it's like you're looking at other people for inspiration and mm -hmm. motivation as opposed to it being like competition. Yeah, like, oh, I'm gonna try one of them. Like, no. I... And also, it kills your inside, you know? Yeah, it's like, it, you know, it, it, it takes away from everything else. It takes right the energy, energy yeah. right here. It takes the energy away from everything else. You being able to write clearly. Don't you find that, that when, you're, when your spirit is there, you're not really able to, to fully enjoy the moment also? Like, you're, like, say for example, for Rumfest, like if you were thinking about everybody else, whatever, whatever, the moment would have passed, you'd have mm -hmm. had such a good time, mm -hmm. but you wouldn't even recognize that yes. you had such a good time yes. because you are busy looking at someone else. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, okay. So, um, transparency. That's happened that new wave. So, and you called me. Oh yes. So, so <laughs> a couple of days, like a day or two before new wave, I shot a video for climbing. Yeah. And basically, my mind was bogged down with climbing is one of what is her newest. Her newest. Yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Um, YouTube, everywhere. Spotify, Apple Music, anything where you listen to music, Amazon, you can yeah. find. So. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. So. I was bogged down mentally with money, thinking about money, thinking about the shots, thinking if we got, you know, and so I knew it was, it did pull away from my presence at New Wave. Now people only, like, I don't know if a lot of people notice, but like you notice and you call me and you're like, Nay, what's going on? 
But it's just I was just overwhelmed. Yeah. You know, and even though I wasn't in a place of jealousy or competition, yeah. but just to show you as an example. Oh, that energy. Oh, that yeah. kind of picture. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so I and what that taught me, that experience taught me is to fight through that and know say, okay, the next time I'm in an environment where I need to perform or I need to whatever, I just have to tap into like this the strength that God has given me and shut that thing down. Cause that could have happened at Rome Fest. Yeah. We don't want to talk about but something yeah. could have happened at Rome Fest that would have thrown me off. Yeah. But I had to do it in the moment. Mm -hmm. Soon as like the music started, I was like, drop it, Naomi, drop it. I had to drop it. Literally, like spiritually drop whatever was going on yeah. and just like run out there. And I'm very like I'm very sensitive to energy. Um mm -hmm. and so I, I when I watched the performance at New Wave, I was like I, I I was just watching Instagram stories. Yeah, I yeah, wasn't Naomi. even there. I wasn't even there. He was yeah, not he even. He was like, "Sis, what's up?" I was, I was like, like, "What's hey. going on?" I was like, "No, man. Like, I see your energy off. Like, mm -hmm. something not right." I was mm -hmm. like, "And the other girl, let me watch what happened. Like, talk to me." He